Parkway Central Middle is currently in the process of creating a more flexible learning environment for students who require more than the traditional way of learning. There are four different academies, one of them being called Legacy, which is the traditional way of learning. The other three are more personalized learning structures called Flex, Design, and Empower. Flex being more focused on students who prefer to work at their own pace, covering skills and standards at their own timing. Design has seminars that combine cross-curricular things that allow students to think outside the box more creatively. And finally, Empower, which is a mixture of all the learning structures, giving students the opportunity to be more empowered and have a say in their learning while still having some traditional learning styles. Talking with PCMS staff, the question of why their administration chose not to make the change is very apparent. I think what really pushed it into the forefront of people's minds right now was COVID and distance learning. And, you know, it kind of forced teachers to be like, some kids during distance learning like flourished and, and did super, super well being at home and being able to work through things on their own pace and, and things like that. And some kids really struggled and it didn't correlate to like achievement or, you know, um, reading level or, you know, it wasn't like all of the super, super advanced kids did super great in distance learning. And so it was kind of that moment where we had to be like, well, we can't teach the same way. Like COVID has had an effect on kids for sure, on their learning styles, on teachers and how they teach. And so why not take this minute to kind of revamp and, and try to address kids' needs where they are and, and do it in whatever way that we can actually address them in a, in a different structure. Teachers at the middle school were given the opportunity to pick which academy they wanted based on their preference and personality. So I chose Empower. Um, I was interested in both Empower and Design, but thinking about personalized learning as the teacher, like I know that I need to meet my kids' needs wherever they are, and I'm seeing different needs than I saw three or four years ago. So I, t I think I'm happy with Empower because it's going to kind of marry those two. Like I think I'm going to be be able to provide the structure that I would have liked in something like Legacy, but also um, playing with ideas of how I can now meet my students' needs in, in creative and, and different structures in different ways. It's important to realize that these academies will allow all students to thrive within their learning in the best way possible. All students are different and require certain layouts to help them perform to the best of their abilities. Legacy isn't better than personalized learning. Personalized learning isn't better than legacy because it depends on the kid and what they need. Um, so it's really more of these personalized learning academies are really more of a um, response to what we're seeing as different needs for different kids. But legacy is going to fit some kids perfectly. Flex is going to fit some kids perfectly and for the other academies as well. This is Rain reporting for PCH TV.